Yo, 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 what up, what up, what up? It's your boy Ty X Worldwide. Now check this out. I got this quote from a Greek philosopher named Epictetus, and he said this, demand not that things happen as you wish, but wish for them to happen as they do, and you will go on well. You see, guys, the best way to gain power is to have self-control because when you have self-control, everything else in your life will fall into place. A lot of people think by trying to control everything, that's how you gain power. No, it actually works in reverse. The harder you try to control everything, the worse it gets. This is why you just got to sometimes just sit back and let things happen. You see, what I notice in my life, Every time I try to force something, it never worked. Every time I try to force things to go according to a plan I had, it never worked. But when I sit back and say it is what it is, that's when things flowed accordingly. It's just like that muddy water analogy I love to use. When you dip your hands in muddy water and try to stir it to make it clear, it gets worse. But when you leave it alone and let it subside, that's when it gets clear. And that's how it be. That's how you have the control. That's how everything works in your favor. Sometimes you have to sit back and just let things happen. Hey, stop trying to force things to happen as you wish. No, let it happen as it's supposed to happen. And it's going to happen the way it's supposed to be. And it's going to go on well. Sometimes y'all be trying to force something. You're like, yo, maybe if I just leave it alone, it's going to be the way it needs to be. It's going to be what it's going to be. It's going to be the right way. See, a lot of times you try to force something, but it's the wrong way. It's not what it's supposed to be. No, maybe a better door going to open for me. You see, a lot of you guys try to kick down that door, trying to force it down. No, 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 we don't do that. Oh, knock one time. Okay, don't want to open up. We're going we, we gonna to go to the next door. And we're going to keep going on to the door that's supposed to be open for us opens. But I'm not trying to kick it down and trying to force my way in it. No, 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 no. You might be missing out on something greater. Guys, there were so many times I kept trying to force my way into something and it never worked. But when I stopped trying... Another direction opened up and another path and it was better than what I was trying to get. That's how it usually happens. That's why you got to stop trying to demand things to happen a certain way. No, let it be. Because sometimes that door you're trying to go through is not the door you need to be going through. Sometimes that job you're forcing to get is not the job that's for you. Sometimes that girl you're cheap trying to get, that's not the girl for you. Sometimes them friendships you're trying to force to hold on to is not the friendship for you. Stop forcing it. Let it happen. Oh, they don't want to cooperate? Okay, cool, leave. That's how you gain the power. That's how you get things done. By not trying. By not trying to force things to happen a, way, a certain way. Sometimes you just got to let it be. Hey, it is what it is. But I'm not forcing it. I'm not trying hard. And guys, that's how you get the power. That's how you get things to happen in your life. And you become more attractive. Because people going to be like, yo, he's not trying. He's not forcing anything. Only thing he's trying to do is become the best version of himself. That's the only thing you need to force is becoming the best version of yourself. Force becoming the best man you can be. And this is why self-control is so important because when you have that self-control, everything else will work in your favor. Things will just start happening. Why? Because you have control over yourself. You realize, hey, look, I know I can't control that. I know that's what it's going to be. However, only I can do is control me. Only I can control is my actions. And you will gain so much power and things will just start working. And I'm telling you from experience, I used to be that guy that tried to control every little thing. I'll be trying to control everything in my life. Like, yo, I need this to happen this way. I try so hard to make things go a certain way and it never worked. It never worked out for me. But when I stopped trying, that's when everything started happening. When I said, I don't give a rat's behind, that's when everything started happening to me. When I stopped trying to force things to happen, that's when things just started forcing its way onto me. I just said, hey, I don't care. It is what it is. I had that I don't care mentality. That's when I started getting the power. That's when people want to be around me. People be trying to talk to me and all that stuff. Why? Because I'm not trying. I'm not trying to gain power. I'm not trying to force people to do nothing they don't want to do. You cool with me? Okay, cool. You not? Okay, cool. And that's why in the quote he said, you will go on well. Because when you try to force things, you're not going to be happy. You're going to be miserable. Guys, how many times have you tried to force something and you became more miserable? You became more angry. Why? Because you kept trying. You was doing all this work trying to get things to go a certain way. But when you step back and say, I ain't trying, that's when it went on well. When you just let things happen. That's how you got to be. You just got to let things happen. Do the best you can and let the rest just happen. That's the mindset you need to have. That's what you need to do. Just do the best you can, and whatever happens, happens. 
But don't try to force it. Don't try to control it. Don't try to... No, no, no. It is what it is. Because a lot of times, you about to get something better. A lot of times, you about to get something that's going to be way better for you. You're going to get a better car, better job, more money. But you ain't going to see that if you keep trying to go according to the plan that you think you're supposed to go. <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. You'll be thinking you have life under control. You'll be thinking, yo, it's going to go this way. But you'll get a whole monkey wrench. I'm telling you, bro, life will hit you with a whole curveball. But, yo, you got to learn how to just let it happen. Say, okay, cool. I got to adjust. It is what it is. But I'm not forcing it. I'm not trying to control nothing. I'm not trying to control nobody. I'm not trying to control nothing. Same thing with your job. Hey, let's say you get fired. Don't be like, yo, you know, uh, hey, man, y'all want to fire me? Cool. Guess what? A better job is coming. I'm telling you that from experience, bro. I got let down so many times, and every time I got let down, a better door open for me, bro. I'm telling you, man. And I don't know who need to hear this right now, but yo, stop forcing it, bro. If that job don't want to hire you, cool. Another one going to come. If that job fire you, cool. A better job going to come and hire you. That girl left you, cool. Another joint going to come that's better. Your friends slimed you out, cool. There's going to be some more friends. That's, yo, listen here, bro. Anything you lose is going to come around in a better form. Anything you lose is going to come around better. That's how it is. That's how life is. But when you try to hold on to something that don't want to be held on to, that's how you lose the power. <laughs> that's how you lose it. When you keep trying to hold on to something, no. Hey, don't try to hold on. That's how you gain the power. That's how it is. When you let things go and just let it be, that's when things happen the way it's supposed to happen. You will get control over everything. See, the real secret to gaining power it's to not try to gain power over everyone. That's how you gain power. Because your life is going to be better. Your life is going to be more fruitful. Your life is going to be better. Everything's going to start working in your favor. Things don't work in people's favor when you start trying to control everything. It ain't going to work in your favor. It's going to get worse. It's going to get worse. You're going to be unhappy. You're going to be miserable and depressed. I'm telling you. Guys, I'm telling you. You're going to be depressed. You're going to be angry and frustrated because nothing is going according to plan because you can't do that. It's impossible. You don't have no power over nobody else. You don't have no power over outside events. You don't have no power over none of that stuff. The only thing you have power over is yourself and your mind. That's why you got to have self-control. That's how you get the power, by having self-control. Because when you have self-control, you're going to be stoic. And when you're stoic, nobody can break you. That's why when you have self-control and people try to play with you or try to disrespect you and you don't react in a certain way, you remain stoic, you have all the power because he who angers you controls you. If they're able to piss you off and get you all riled up, they control you. If they're able to get under your sin, they can control you. That's why self-control is important because when you have that self-control, they're not going to have that power over you. That's why I practice stoicism. That's why I practice self-control. That's why I tell you guys these things. So nobody can have the power over you to manipulate you and doing things that you don't need to be doing. Out here looking crazy. No. You need to have power over your mind. Have power over yourself. That's how you gain the power. You see, nobody can have power over you when you have self-control. They can't control you. They can't do anything to you. Why? Because you have control over yourself. And you willing to just let things happen. So if you want to act a fool, okay, cool. I'm not going to lower myself down to act a fool with you. <laughs> if you want to disrespect me, cool. I'm not going to deal with you because I have self-respect. You see? See how that works? Everything starts with self. So no matter what you do, it's not going to mess anything I got over here. Because I have control over myself. I have self-respect. So if you don't want to respect me, you don't have to be around me. I'm not going to talk to you. I'm not going to deal with you. Why? Because you have power over yourself. You're not going to let anybody else come in here and sway you. That's how you gain the power. And here's the thing. People are going to have to conform to you. Guys, when you operate like that, when you have that type of energy and that mindset, people are going to have no choice but to conform to you. And it took me a long time to figure this out because I tried to control everything in my life. And every time I tried to control it, it got worse. And it made me frustrated. So I had to just say, you know what? I'm not trying to control nothing but myself and my actions. That's when things started working out. That's when... Things started going in my favor, but you have to master that, bro. You have to master that. It got to become a daily thing. Guys, that right there is your superpower, self-control. 
indifference. Guys, if you don't know any other word, you need to know the word indifference. That needs to be ingrained in you. That word needs to be like your number one word. Screw everything else. Indifferent. You need that because when you're indifferent, you will have the power. And guys, when you practice that and develop that trait, you will become more attractive. I'm telling you, bro. When I started adopting this mindset, I started getting better women. Women started coming around me more. Women actually started approaching me, starting to talk to me. Why? Because they see my energy. They see I'm not trying to force things. They see I'm not trying to go out here and try to prove nothing. I'm just me. And I just let things happen as it is. Guys, I don't try to be like nobody else but me. I don't try to imitate anybody else. No, I'm just me. Y'all already know. I'm raw, uncut, straightforward, no nonsense. That's just how I am. Sometimes it come off as arrogant, but I don't care. People are like, oh, you're cocky, you're arrogant. It is what it is. I don't care what you think about me. I'm me. Whether you like it or not. You like it? Cool. You don't? I don't care. That's the mindset you need to have. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care what you think. I don't care. I'm not here to please you. I'm not trying to please you. I'm not trying to get you to like me. I'm not trying to control your emotions. I'm not trying to do any of that. I'm here to be me. I'm here to control myself. I'm here to become the best version of myself. That's the mindset you need to have. And when you do that, you'll realize you'll gain all the power you need and you'll become more attractive. Bottom line, guys, just focus on yourself. Continue to elevate and only deal with the women that want to deal with you. Point blank period, all right? It's your boy Ty X Worldwide, man. I hope you got the message in this video. Just like all my videos, there is a message in there. Y'all already know what to do, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Get with y'all another time.